First, let's check the parcel. Second, open it and check the items inside. The DVR box. The Ethernet cable and the user manual. The three power supplies for the DVR and the cameras. One mouse and two of one to four splitter cables. The camera's boxes. The BMC port. The power port. Mount screws. The 60 feet PMC video and power cable boxes. The 60 feet PMC cable. The female port for the DVR. The male port for the cameras. Let's connect the system now. Plug the power supply for the DVR. Connect the HDMI or VGA cable. Connect the mouse. It will flash after connected the network cable. Now, connect the power supply to the splitter cable. The power port. Connect the female port to the DVR. Let's come to the mail port. Please connect them well. Please connect all the cameras one by one. You will view the picture immediately.
Now go to the DVR setting. The default user is admin and keep password in black. Time and language setting. The network test. You can scan the QR code to download the app on your phone for remote access. The serial number for remote access. Now go to the functional setting. Right click mouse, you will see those functions. The record mode. The playback setting. Choose the channel and the time. Click the switch. You can find the video here if recorded successfully. The view window. The system setting. The network information. The advanced setting. You need to install the HDD inside the DVR. New HDD need to be formatted before recording. The account setting is about adding other users or modifying password. We can find the serial number here. The NAT status should be connected if you want to remote access on your phone. If any problem, please contact our customer service. Thank you.